having a good schedule, and, and, but, and then you've got to do well in your tournament, and I think they've really shown well in their tournament. A blocking foul call. Jenny Baranchek just ran immediately to the floor, seeing that Skylar Van was in great pain. You could see her leg buckled as she yeah. went to the floor, and she's pounding the floor. So Jenny Baranchek just sprinted onto the court. Yeah, I just don't like to see that. Skylar Van is such an important part of this team as she was named the sixth player of the year in the Big 12. She is going to be helped to her feet. Yeah, it's the opposite knee that she has a sleeve on. And we just hope that is not as serious as it looked as she went down. Her knee buckled. The officials, Lisa Jones, Mike Forsberg, and Kevin Peftel, taking a look. What's the. There was some conversation going on between Jenny Baranchek. As, and Nikki Collin. Now the crowd decides to get into it. It didn't look from our angle like there was anything no. that would rise to an intentional foul. It looked just looked like as Van was driving hard, it, right. legs got tangled up. Yeah, and I, I don't know if something was said on the sideline, and uh, you just have to get, get word on that. Caitlin Bickle is actually going to go over to Skylar Van. Yeah, heated words between Nikki Collin and Jenny Baranchek, the officials separating them earlier. But what a show of sportsmanship by Caitlin Bickle then to run over to Skylar Van and make sure and ask if she was okay. Gabby yeah. Gregory checks in to shoot the free throw. Yeah, and that's that's not uh, Baranchek's. I, I, I don't think she's... Was arguing or whether that's just uh, I don't 